What's good? What's good? What's good, y'all? What's up? How y'all doing, man? You already know who it is, man. It's your boy AJ, man. <laughs> Back again, once again, with a brand new topic. You know what to do, man. Like, subscribe, comment to the page, hit the bell, post notification to keep up with this type of content. So now, <laughs> I'm back, man. You know, man, I just been moving and thinking and wondering, man. You know, I apologize for not dropping no videos lately. I've been going through it. But I ain't finna worry about it, man. We we just finna we just finna keep it moving and grooving. So, you know, I've been on you no, know, I've been on the internet watching stuff. And I've been on YouTube a lot. And on YouTube, I watch the Drink Champs podcast. And I watch the Irv Gotti podcast. You know what I'm saying? I watch Irv Gotti's jump with, you know, him on Drink Champs. And it was a, it was a good pod. It was a good interview, but uh, some things that he said kind of disturbed me a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Especially the things he said towards Ashanti. Now, we all know it ain't no secret. Him and Ashanti were a thing back in the day. During the Murder Inc. era. Everybody knows that that ain't that ain't that ain't no secret. But it puzzles me how. How the hell can a man still can just let something that happened over 20 some odd years ago get to him to the point where he's still in his feelings about it? I don't get that shit. I don't get it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's crazy. Like, I don't get it. You know, like, nigga, like, okay, all right, let's, 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 let's put the elephant in the room. All right, let's, let's throw it out there. All right, nigga, you smash Ashanti. Okay. Y'all made songs together. Okay. Y'all was a couple or whatever y'all had going on, Kirk. Why is you still dwelling on that? Why is you still speaking this girl's name up? Now, if you have not been hiding in a rock, <laughs> they've been going back and forth for a while. For years, you know what I'm saying? Ever since everything of Murder, Inc. happened. Ever since, you know, the Feds investigation when, you know what I'm saying, with Irv and... Shug and uh, Jay Prince was trying to build their own distribution company. Them feds came along and shut them down. But the thing is, why you had to bring up Ashanti's name, bro? Like, why, like, why, why, like, what, what, what is the point? Like, let me, let me, let me, let me show you what I mean. I'm going to play a clip of, um... Of, of Irv talking about how the song Happy was created on the Drink Champs. Of course, I can't show you the video, you know what I'm saying, fair use all day long, but I just want y'all to hear this real quick, man. I just want y'all to hear this nonsense. And, and tell me, does this, does this not sound crazy? And I work, and I work to yeah, a at this point. <laughs> yes. Okay. So we're together. Match your watches. I imagine you both are watched too. I bought a mad shit. Okay. Okay. Birkin, it's all that. All right. I bought, she, she, she ganked. Uh -huh. okay. I don't know about none of these things. I just know. Okay. okay. So you Switzerland. Stay out of it. I'm Switzerland. Yeah, 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 yeah. We just finished sleeping together or whatever. Okay. I'm taking a shower. I'm in the shower. <laughs> You know, a nigga be creative after. Yes. Right? Yes. Like, 
Mine sound like a child talking about another female. Like, God, leave, bro. It was that good to the point where you got to brag about it like that. Like, come on, bro. Like, come on. Like, come on. It, 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 it clearly shows, man. A lot, of you, a lot of you Negroes, bro. A lot of you niggas be letting these females F y'all heads up, bro. And I can name a lot more other dudes, a lot more other niggas than her Gotti that are on the same type of stuff. But this will be a long video if I do all that, man. But yeah, man, it's stupid. Like, why are you bringing this girl name up after all these years? You that mad that Nelly was smashing her? You was that upset, my nigga? You had a shanty. Yay! Who gives a f Who gives a rat's ass, bro? Who cares? Don't nobody care, bro. You know what I'm saying? Where was you? You know what I'm saying? When Ja Rule had to defend Murder Inc. by himself. You feel what I'm saying? Why you worrying about a shanty? Why you want coming like why you want coming at why you want coming at 50 cent that hard at that time when G unit was just ro rolling over you niggas in New York <laughs> What was that energy when Mike Geronimo and them you know what I'm saying you screwed over Mike Geronimo you talk all that mess about the bruh and he was one of your first prospects he was a dope MC in his era you know what I'm saying? That never really got his shine because of you. You know what I'm saying? You brought his name on like, what's the point, my nigga? Why? You know, like, what what point is you trying to prove? Yeah, you got the little $300 million deal. Good for you. But I'd like to know what you had to do to get that. I like to know what you had to do to get that. Cause the last time I checked, you was only dealing with BET doing the little tail stuff. The little tails movies. And even that didn't last long. So I like to know what did you do to get that little three hundred million dollar deal? And another thing I like to ask, if Ergotti can get this video. Why you you stole Ashanti's masters in publishing? She's still trying to fight for her. She posed to get them, but I guess she don't. In your interview, it sounds like you still withholding it. Do do um ja Rule on his publishing and masters for all the songs he made. Do he own his stuff? What happened to Vita? The first, the original first lady of Murder Inc. The rapper. What happened to Vita? You screwed her over too. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm like, come on, man. These industry niggas are suckers, bro. I don't have no respect for none of these industry niggas. None. I don't care if you're a rapper, a producer, an engineer. If you a sucker, you a sucker, man. I'm going to call a spade a spade all day long. Ain't nothing going to change. I hate when a dude try to talk so tough about a female. That dude, that be pissing me off. You know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of you dudes be suckers, man. Like, I, I don't be getting you niggas, man. <laughs> I don't get these niggas out here, man. I swear to God, bro. And this man, what? He about, what, damn near 50? And Ashanti, she just hit her early 40s. Oh, yeah, I, yeah, she just hit her... Close to her early 40s. Still look good. Still fine as wine. You mad because you can't tap into that no more. Your life is in shambles, bro. And you mad that it's in shambles. You think because you simped a little bit for back in the early 2000s, you think you own, you own her. You don't own nothing, nigga. You don't even own yourself, nigga. You feel what I'm saying? And that's why everybody coming for your head. Because you's a sucker. You still bringing up old shit 
from back in the day for no reason. <laughs> I don't understand these niggas, man. Boy, I tell you. But yeah, man, that was the topic for the day, man. Y'all jump in the comments, man. Tell me how y'all feel about this situation, man, between Irv and Ashanti, man. This, this is crazy. <laughs> but yeah, man. I'm gone, man. Catch me in the next video, man. Like, comment, subscribe to all the videos, man. Hit that bell, man. Peace and one love.